Okay, so I'll be honest with you. I've been using my DJI Osmo Action 4 for these Talking Head Studio shots. And, um, and I've been trying to minimize my overall production setup. And so since I made my video a couple days, a couple weeks ago on um, the Rode VideoMic NTG, I have decided to streamline my whole kit to just being the DJI Osmo Action 4 and my Rode VideoMic NTG and, uh, and one USB-C cable to go between them. And in my opinion, I think it's one of those one of those great kind of minimalist vlogging setups. So if you were using your Action 4 for vlogging or um, talking head, it, uh, yeah, it just streamlines everything and makes things super simple. But there is one problem. That is the VideoMic NTG is a large microphone. And when it's on the cold shoe of this um, of this PGY Tech cage for my Action 4, yeah, it kind of gets it kind of gets in the way. And so when it comes to figuring out solutions like this, I um, I like to think out of the box. And there is one out of the box accessory for your camera that I think fits the bill for this particular situation. And this will hold true for any camera and microphone combination where you want to mount the microphone on top of your camera in in their hot shoe or cold shoe mount. And that's this, the Toizo monitor mount. And one of the problems I find when I mount a microphone onto a cold shoe or hot shoe of a camera is that it um, it is never aimed at where my mouth is. If it's in a large mirrorless or DSLR and I'm holding my camera out, I'm framing my shot with the lens and the microphone on top of the camera is is pretty much an afterthought when it comes to positioning, right? And it ends up shooting, it ends up pointing directly at your forehead or sometimes even over your head, depending on where you are in, in the framing of your shot. Um, in the case of using action cameras to vlog, it doesn't, um, there isn't enough space between where the end of your microphone is and the field of view of your camera lens for it to not fall into your shot. And so something like a monitor mount like this one by Tozo, I think it's I think it's Tozo, uh, accomplishes a couple different things. First, it allows you to raise your microphone off of your cold shoe just that extra distance to get that microphone out of the shot. And so you can see that I have mine um, well, you can't see, but I have mine mounted on top of my Action 4 and uh, yeah, it it is extended kind of pretty far out in front of the camera and the end of the wind muff is not falling into my shot. Um, second of all, and this is probably the more important thing, because it has a tilt feature and because it is a quarter thread um, attachment, you can really adjust the positioning of your microphone to get the optimal sound. So it's not pointing at your forehead, it's not pointing above your head, but you can angle it slightly off center. You can tip it down depending on where your cold shoe is on your camera to really optimize your mic position. And I'll tell you what, when it comes to vlogging scenarios, situations where your microphone is on top of your camera, any small adjustment that you can make to better position your microphone can make a huge difference when it comes to the quality of your audio. So say for example, I am on this side of my frame, I have the microphone pointed to me here. Let's see, if I lean this way and I'm on the other third of the frame and now I'm talking to the camera, you should hear a significant difference in the audio that's being recorded just by how I move because of my mic positioning. And so let's go back to, let's go back to this side and there you go. I mean, those are the kind of differences that, um, that mic position can make. And especially when you are prioritizing things like your camera and, uh, your, your shot and the camera position and where you're holding it. And the microphone can sometimes, I know, be a total afterthought because a lot of creators just slap it on top of their camera hit record and uh and go for the best right but if you take a little bit of extra time 
and thought into how you're positioning your microphone, yeah, you can get significantly better audio just by doing that small thing without making any other kind of adjustments to uh, your equipment or your your gain settings or anything like that. And so um, I, for one, am sold on these kind of monitor mounts for fine-tuned positioning for mics when they're on top of my camera. If you want a link to this particular product, I'll, I'll put it in the description. Um, otherwise, there are a few other variations. I think Small Rig makes one and um, a couple other companies make them. But what I like about this one specifically is that it has a locking lever on the side. Some of them only have locking Allen wrench uh, nuts or bolts. And so having that lever allows you to adjust it on the fly really quickly without having to have any extra tools. So hope this helps. Hope you're sounding better with your recordings. And we'll talk again real soon.